You can't talk about the real estate market without looking back a few years. Though the housing crash and Great Recession occurred more than a decade ago, the crisis is still very much on everybody's minds, especially those looking to enter into the real estate market today. Hi, I'm Kimberly DeSocio with Coldwell Banker, your South Florida connection. More than 7 million Americans lost their homes during the housing crash, which took place between 2007 and 2009 and missed the Great Recession. The problem stemmed from a few issues occurring during this time period. Risky and fraudulent lending practices which allowed home buyers to purchase homes or take out mortgages that were way beyond their means. Blind secondary market activity which made it difficult to spot low quality loans that were being originated. Rising interest rates which made adjustable rate mortgage loans unaffordable to many Americans who had them. Quickly deteriorating home prices which made it difficult for homeowners and banks to sell their properties once they fell into default. Naturally, the fear of another similar event has many worried, especially with the recession predictions running rampant. Things are totally different today. Thankfully, lending standards have been tightened since the years of the crash. And thanks to the Dodd-Frank Act, the Home Mortgage Disclosure Act, and other laws, there are more protection in place than ever. As you can see, we have so many different factors in today's market versus back in 2007, which shows us that we are not headed for another crash. Our market has just been leveling out and stabilizing. Don't sit on the fence. Take advantage of the great rates that are out there right now. You could get more house for your dollar. If you have more questions, comment below. My mission is to keep you as educated as possible. And remember, knowledge is power, so let's all share it. I'm Kimberly DeSocio with Coldwell Banker, your South Florida connection to your next property.